Hi Tana, I'm in your business card file here. So if I push W, you can see our bleed, um, that red line that goes all the way around the business card. Looks like you have it on there, which is great. Um, and you're, luckily you did put your background image, um, you know, at least or past the bleed line, which is perfect. Um, if I push W, you know, the bleed line comes here. If I push W, you can see this is where the actual business card would be trimmed to. So the printer, you know, a physical printer cannot print up to the edge of a business card. So it's printed on a bigger piece of paper with the bleed and then it's trimmed down to size. So that's why we put bleeds on things. Uh, so I'll show you how to export out file, export out a PDF um, for print. And I'm just going to click on your old one to name it the same. Make sure it's on a PDF print save, push replace. I'm going to actually replace your file because you didn't have your bleed included, which I believe is probably more my fault than yours because I don't think I explained this very well in class. Um, and I didn't affect your grade, but I did mention it. So under marks and bleeds, you can go through here. It's almost like a little um, menu as you're exporting out a PDF. Everything should be correct. I mean, go into general and check all pages are checked. It's on pages. Compression, we don't need to worry about. Marks and bleeds, this is where you would click Use Document Bleed Settings and then export that out. Um, I'm missing your fonts because I didn't install them, but I did look at your JPEG. Okay, so then if we go back into your thing, I think my, my computer might be acting a little goofy, honestly, Tana, but that would be how you would export out a PDF. Um, Yeah, one or more background. Yeah, something's going on with my computer. But anyway, that that is how you would export out that PDF. You got to tick that little box uh, when exporting out the PDF to get the bleed included in the PDF file. All right, talk to you later. Hope you have a good holiday, and hopefully we'll see you next spring.